roll. Fuck, triple seven. Hello world, this is the Hacker 7 and today I'm bringing you guys a video requested by one of my subscribers how to make custom third party Windows 7 themes. Now I'm just going to push you guys to tip the edge here. Um, there is much more you guys can do. I'm just going get to you, get you guys started and then show you a couple different tweaks and then from there you can basically take it on yourself. So you're going to need two programs. You're gonna you're going to need your favorite resource editor and um, a program called Style 7.10. It's Style 7 basically. That's what it's called. And then for resource editor, my favorite resource editor, it's free, it's called Resource, resource Hacker. That is my favorite one. Um, I'll put a link in the description for that one. If you have your own, use it yourself. I don't really care. So first thing we're going to do is you want to start up style 7. Let's so run it. So I want to install it. And this basically allows you to make a basic theme. So as you see you have very basic options and then if you want you can hit install new theme and what this is is it basically just installs the theme on your computer that's all it does very basic program so what you do, what you can do though is you can apply like for example the steam right here to your computer and then using the following steps you can edit certain parts so once you're done with this you hit apply and then you're basically done now I'm not going to do that because obviously I like my theme next you're going to need to edit these four files now you can obviously you can edit much more and I might do another video after this sometime um, with more advanced ones but for now we're just going to do these so what you need to you, you just want to open up is you want to open up um, Windows Explorer and create a new folder somewhere. So I'm just gonna create a new folder called Theme. Now I'm gonna open it up. Now what you want to do is, you're going to want to go to these locations. So I'm going to open up a new window again. Again, I'll have these locations in the description. Okay, so from here, we're going to go to C Windows. And we're going to want to find Explorer EXE. There we go. As you see, I have many explorers. What we're going to want to do copy and paste. Now, by doing this, um, we're creating backups basically. And then we'll use this folder to distribute it to any website. We also going to want to get Explorer Frame. Oh, sorry, no. You, 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 sorry, you do not want that. That's the wrong Explorer frame. <laughs> Next, we're going to go to System32. And this Explorer frame. This is the Explorer frame we want, sorry. As you can tell, these certain, the Explorer frame edits this color right here and stuff like that. Um, 
Now, now we're going to watch Shell 32. Shell 32. Now I want to do a backup version so you guys can see one that I believe is already, already edited so you guys can see the difference. And uh, this one right here I want to show you guys is one that you necessarily don't need to really edit. It's just if you really want to make your theme a little bit you know, better than the average theme I guess, you can do this one. This one is called Time Date. Now what Time Date is is there it is and paste. time date is right here this whole area as you see my time date wasn't edited for this theme so it's still actually black so okay now we're gonna need we can close this and we can open up your favorite res resource editor mine's resource hacker Again, I'll have a link in the description to download this free free program. Now, I can believe... Okay, so there you go. So all you have to do is drag... Uh, all you gotta do is drag it on there. So first off, we'll explore... We're gonna start with Explorer Frame. So, now, this works for any program, for anything. The, each program will have its own different ones, but they'll all have Icon for sure. And they'll all have Icon Group and 24. But you're gonna open up Icon, and you're gonna go in here and find um, images, basically. So by clicking here, as you see, you can change this image. As you see, it gets bigger and bigger. And if we go up here, we have a different one. And then basically, if you go through different areas, here we have the back buttons. So as you see, my my explorer, the back buttons are already changed, and there's the, there's the back button again, and then different ones like that, and more back buttons. So see, I'm just gonna show you how to do this one. So um, you can do this for all of them though. So uh, open up all of them, and then just throw through the icons and see the ones you can change. From here, you're gonna go to action, and you're gonna go and replace. You can go action, and then you can save. You can save all resources. Okay, there we're right here. If you go hit replace, and then now now we go and we can basically get to our own image. So it has to be it has to be a B either an exe file, a dll file, a .res file, or .bmp. So for most people, they'll have a .bmp. So you go to you go into your pictures, and you'll obviously already have one ready. And then you can go and you can just select your own image. And then once you've done that, it will have the option right here to replace, and hit replace, and then that's it. And then then basically after that you can go through the next one so you can just drag this one in here and we do that and then you can go down to icon again and this one, as you see this one is a lot more so we'll just go like this one here and here we go, we get this icon with the explorer icon one's explorer so then all you gotta do, you gotta go to action or you can just right click it actually. Right click this one right here. Replace resource. Open file with new icon. And replace. And then you do that for all of them. And then I'll have the, I'll have the list of this list right here in the description. So that's about it for this video. I um, hope you guys liked it. Uh, I might be coming up with a little more advanced. If you guys come up with any more files to edit, post comments below. I'll make sure that I'll like them so to make sure that make sure that top. And that's about it for this video. Hope I hope you guys hope you like the video and have a nice day. This is the Hacker Triple O seven and I'm signing off.